Welcome back. The top court will resume hearing on cases of violence against women in Manipur. Remember, the court had taken cognizance of the shocking a video of two women being paraded naked and molested in a violence hit Manipur. In the last hearing, the Chief Justice of India had summoned Manipur DGP Rajiv Singh to answer queries on delay in filing affairs. Yes, a very crucial uh, hearing as far as the Manipur crisis is concerned, as you rightly said. Uh, today, uh, on, the la on the last date of hearing, there is an August 1st, uh, the Chief Justice, after noting that there is a complete uh, breakdown of law and order and uh, also a constitutional machinery has uh, very significantly uh, summoned uh, DGP of the state, uh, Rajiv Singh, uh, to be present uh, today at 2 p.m. and uh, it's definite that he will be facing very tough questions as far as the law and order situation, uh, arrest of uh, accused, uh, recording of uh, witness statement, and also uh, registration of FIRs is uh, concerned. On the last date of hearing, the Supreme Court has said that it is uh, noted from the status report filed by the state that there is a lot of time lag, lot of gap between the date of occurrence and registration of FIRs, and also questioned uh, why, uh, despite uh, registering 6,500 plus affairs, there is no bifurcation of the offences like uh, uh, murder, uh, how many murder affairs, how many rape and sexual assault affairs, how many affairs for grievous hurt, how many affairs for damage of property, residential and work, uh, places of worship. And, uh, and in fact, the uh, Supreme Court also hinted that it will form a judicial panel uh, which, and the focus of it will be uh, payment of compensation, relief and rehabilitation and uh, confidence building measures and an audit uh, in this regard uh, maybe uh, is expected uh, today. Uh, the Supreme Court also uh, will ask the DGP as to uh, the statement uh, recorded by the two uh, women in the viral video that they were thrown to the mob by the policemen and the DGP will be asked several questions including why no action was taken against the policemen. Meanwhile, a situation remains grim in the violence at state of Manipur. Imphal West District Magistrate has notified that curfew will be relaxed today for citizens from 5 a.m. to 12 p.m. in all areas of Imphal West District. However, Biren Singh-led government in Manipur faces a double whammy after minor NDA partner Kuki People's Alliance withdrew support from the government and now Meti Outfit Coordinating Committee on a Manipur integrity has appealed for an indefinite social boycott. The move is uh, promulgated by same set of people who had publicly prevented the Chief Minister from resigning on June 30. The development comes as centre sent 800 additional central forces to Manipur on Saturday after fresh violence left six dead and 16 injured.